The most distant human A object floating in the dark sky is NASA's legendary Voyager 1 spacecraft. This tiny machine has done what once looked impossible in every scene, crossing the endless interstellar space. Think of the moment when this spacecraft was launched nearly half a century ago, a different ERA with no smartphones or modern screens. It was a time in history when technology was simple, yet this single craft kept moving forward in the cold black space. Even today, the Voyager is still alive, still whispering across stars, still giving humanity its cosmic secrets. This story is not only about science but also about human legacy, a reminder written in the sky of what curiosity can do. It is more than a relic drifting in the cosmic darkness, it is a messenger reaching back with signals from the edge of the galaxy. Across billions of miles, the spacecraft keeps sending data using old technology that makes a cassette player look futuristic on the table. The Voyager was launched in 1977, and its discoveries shocked the world of science, leaving researchers stunned under the observatory dome. The universe was forever changed by the details this spacecraft revealed in its long sky-bound journey. To understand the scale of these achievements, we must return to a moment when NASA engineers were still dreaming under the glowing stars. It was the early 1970s, and visionaries at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory drew bold ideas across paper charts. At the heart of the dream stood Gary Flandro, a brilliant scientist who mapped with pencil on his desk and cosmic vision in his mind. He discovered a rare alignment of planets forming a pathway through space, like stepping stones across a solar ocean. This chance created a cosmic highway, where gravity from each giant planet could fling a spacecraft like a slingshot through the void. Instead of thirty long years, this alignment could shorten the journey to twelve swift rotations around the shining sun. The only catch was the rarity of this scene. Such a paddle appears only once every 176 years in the planetary dance. Miss it, and humanity would wait nearly two centuries watching the sky in silence for another chance. NASA could not hesitate. The narrow window gave them only 15 days to launch two spacecraft into the cold universe. So in the summer of 1977, two nearly identical machines roared into the clouds, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. No one truly imagined these twins would become humanity's greatest explorers under the glowing cosmos. Their official mission was supposed to last four years, just a brief scouting trip through the planetary system. But destiny wrote another script, and 45 years later, both voyagers still send daily messages from the frozen outer space. They were meant to be scouts but instead became pioneers, rewriting what humanity knew about the glowing universe. Voyager's first close images of Jupiter's moons were breathtaking, painting new pictures of fiery volcanic lands. Io shocked scientists when it showed live volcanoes spitting fire into the black space, instead of being a frozen rock. Europa revealed hints of deep oceans beneath its icy shell, oceans that may shelter life in hidden depths. Saturn revealed secrets too, with rings so complex they looked alive, stretching in patterns across the glowing sky. Its moons surprised observers with thin atmospheres and surfaces shaped by alien winds and frozen rivers. Voyager 2 became a trailblazer, reaching Uranus in 1986 and Neptune in 1989 in its mysterious space-bound path. For the first time, entire worlds were unveiled, giant frozen spheres ploked in storms and thick clouds. From 14 billion kilometers away, a small craft no bigger than a car astonished watchers under glowing stars. What was once a probe had transformed into an explorer, navigating cosmic seas no map had ever charted. Yet, for all its glory, the Voyager itself was humble, with only 69 kilobytes of memory inside its box. That is less than a single photo on today's phone, yet it stored its world-shaping discoveries on magnetic tape. With just 23 watts of power, weaker than a household light, it sent signals across the dark space. 
A huge 12-foot antenna beamed those whispers using radio waves traveling at light speed across the black void. But every day the distance grew, forcing signals to take longer through the empty cosmic sea. Today, a Voyager signal takes over 18 hours to reach Earth, threading through noisy human-made radio skies. Television, satellites, and cell phones fill the atmosphere with interference that crowds the air waves. Yet, against these odds, faint whispers from Voyager still arrive, carrying secrets from the faraway edge. Beyond the planets, beyond Pluto's frozen horizon, lies a frontier of icy bodies in the mysterious Oort cloud. Voyager is not there yet, but it crossed another line, the invisible helipores, boundary of the sun's glowing bubble. Here the solar wind stops, and the interstellar medium begins, a region that marks the space between shining stars. For decades, scientists argued where this border stood, sketching numbers on their glowing data screens. Then on August 25, 2012, Voyager crossed, and the data revealed higher plasma densities in its surrounding space. But strangely, the magnetic field direction barely changed, leaving scientists unsettled under observatory domes. Crossing into a new realm should have shifted magnetic forces, yet the invisible lines stayed strangely steady. This discovery shook the community, raising questions about what interstellar space truly looks like beyond the glowing sun. Were we wrongly our maps of the galaxy? Was this universe stranger than humanity dared to imagine? Voyagers became more than machines. They turned into messengers drifting with golden records in the black sky. Each carried greetings, music, and drawings etched on gold plates, symbols of Earth drifting across cosmic seas. These golden records are time capsules, a story of humankind waiting for alien eyes to find someday. Perhaps faraway civilizations will encounter them and hear the music of waves, birds, and human voices. As they sail deeper into the cosmic ocean, farther than any human-made craft, they keep inspiring new imagination. Exploration, the voyagers remind us, is not about reaching an end, but about pushing each glowing horizon. They were never built to last this long, yet they are still surviving, still traveling through cold space. Even with humble technology, powered by courage and curiosity, these machines show no real limits under the vast sky. When you glance up at the night sky, at faint stars blinking in the dark, think of Voyager's silent travel. Out there, two small spacecraft keep going, carrying humanity's story into the boundless cosmic unknown. With each passing second, they drift further, taking a piece of humanity with them into the endless void. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.